Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be making a PO box opening video for you. I actually haven't done one of these in a while so it'd be really nice to go through all the mail that's come over the last few months. Um, as you can see I've even had some from Christmas time so I'm really, really excited to open these ones up. So I'll go through them one by one as per usual and you'll just be seeing my hands. So we'll start off with the Christmas one here. I'll bring the camera down so you can see it more in detail and let's get started. Alright, so this one's from Naomi. We've actually sent, I've sent a few letters off to her uh, over the past few years. Haven't opened it yet. This one was from Christmas and I was so excited when I saw this. It's a Totoro Christmas tree. How freaking awesome is that? And as you can see, it's the little baby Totoro's on top there. And I was just so excited. I was like, I can't open this up until I do a um, pair box opening video. So I've had this one in my stash for a little while. Um, so this is such a beautiful little paper clip here. It's a little flower, a rose or something. I think it might just be a card. I'll just make sure. <gasps> okay, so there's a little letter in here. And look at all these goodies. Oh my goodness. Such a cute idea. Handmade card. So let me get that in focus. Now, oh, I can see lots of sticker girls, which is so exciting because you guys know how much I love my sticker girls. I'll see if I can get it all out for you. I usually don't open packages all the way up, but <laughs> this is way too exciting. Oop, it got stuck. Oh my goodness, it's a little Christmas Starbucks. Oh, these are so cute. Oh, look! Hey, Sheen, and it's the Simpsons. These are so cool. Little sticker girls. Oh, Milky! Oh my goodness, this is going straight into my... Oh, look, these are going straight into my journal. I love that one. These are so cute. Look at these little girls. I love them. Some Christmassy ones, some more sticker girls. Those are really cute. Christmas, Christmas, and some just really pretty vintage stamp stickers. I really, I, that's like my favorite sticker pack. That's so cool. You've got my style down pat perfectly. And this is going straight in my journal, of course, because you guys know how much I love my Totoro. Thank you so much, um, Naomi, and I'll send you back a reply when I get around to um, sending some more pen pal letters off this month. So next is this beautiful cacti mail. Now I was actually having a chat with the girl who sent me this on Instagram. I've actually opened it up already. I haven't looked inside yet though. I just had to open all the mail up because um, I know that your address is on the back. So, oh, what's inside? All right. Oh, I'll flip it over so it's the right way around. Oh, all about me. So we've got this little letter here that I'm guessing is going to be lots of interesting facts, hopefully. I don't know. <laughs> And the little letter, so we can read that off screen. Little mail tag, very, very cute. <gasps> What's this? Goodies. I'll make sure that's in focus. Oh, how do I open this? Oh, it's little. Oh, how cute. <laughs> Washi samples, little memo stickers. Um, I wanted to send you some tea, but the post office didn't allow me. Oh, that's all right. I can send you some tea back, though. <laughs> um, it seems like there's a little bit of a balloon theme going on here. And some beautiful stickers. So we've got the heart ones. Stickers for you. And then these little food ones here. Make sure it's in focus. Thank you, Gabriella. I cannot wait to read your letter. So next, I actually got this one in the mail. Um, yesterday it was. And I was absolutely obsessed with this envelope because it's got Totoro's on it. It's got these beautiful stickers all around here. And it's just the most beautiful envelope I think I've ever seen. I'm putting this straight into my journal. I'm just going to stick it in there because I want to keep it forever and ever. Um, so, again, another beautiful Totoro washi tape, which I'm absolutely obsessed with. And I'm going to keep. Oh no, I'm going to have to rip this to get into it, I think. Oh, how pretty. I might have to take a photo on my phone before I continue. Sorry, I'm going to have to pause this. Alright, so I just took a photo because when people do the most amazing wrapping, I have to keep a memory of it and post it on Instagram sometimes. <laughs> 
Oh my goodness, how cool is this? <gasps> That's such a good idea, look at that. She's just made a really simple pocket and it looks fabulous. All right, so, ooh, oh my goodness, I'm so excited. Okay, the letter, and she's absolutely wrapped this beautifully and it's like a little shaker pocket, look at that. You guys just really outdo yourselves. Oh my goodness, <gasps> what is in here? I'm so excited. All right, for you, read me. Oh, is there, okay, there's writing on the back. I don't know if I should read that on camera. Oh, how cute, I don't wanna wreck anything. <gasps> I hope I don't wreck this when I open, I wanna keep this sticker. Yes, I did it. Stuff for your pen paling. It looks like a whole bunch of writing paper. Yes! Oh, this is so cool. So we've got little writing paper. How pretty is this? Oh my goodness. Oh, how cute is that little one? This makes me so happy. And then I'm guessing the big version of the little ones. <laughs> oh no, there's different ones. This is so cute. Oh, this is so cute. I'm obsessed. I don't want to use it. It's so pretty. Okay. Absolutely adorable thank you so much for that and then there's more goodies oh my goodness <gasps> no look oh my goodness Alice thank you so much for all these goodies I'm obsessed with this sticker sheet here this is so so pretty so Alice from the Netherlands I love this so much I can't I've, I'm like beaming I'm so happy right now Honestly, I really, really appreciate this so much. All right, and then there's more. Oh my goodness. Look how cute. What is in these? <gasps> no. <gasps> the washi tape. Look. Look at these washi samples. Oh my goodness. I'm so excited to use these. And then this adorable little writing paper. Oh, this is the nicest. Oh, I don't know. How do you open this? <gasps> what have I done? What have I done? What? What? I'm so confused. <gasps> Are these sticker flakes? Oh my goodness. Okay, that is so cool. Thank you. I'm not going to open each one of these. Um, just because I know that I'm going to make a big mess. But thank you so much. So we've got sticker flakes. We've got little writing paper, washi samples, adorable little bags, writing paper as well, the letter, which is already adorable in itself, as well as amazing, um, beautiful sticker sheets. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much, Alice. I'll reply back as soon as I can. So this next one is from Carissa Turner, um, and we've actually written to each other a few times now. Oh, this is so cute. Okay, what's what's this? Okay, so that's the letter. Then we've got a little bag. With, what? <laughs> with a little sausage dog. <laughs> that's so random. I don't know what to do with him. Why is he on the stick for? Wait, there's more things. Oh my goodness, what are these? The bag's full of B, R, I... I think I know what this spells. T T A. Oh no, we're missing an A. A N Y. That's so cute. I can put that on my um, fridge. <laughs> and then this cute little doggy. All right, we'll move that down so we can see what's inside this beautiful envelope here. Oh no, I'm gonna rip it. I really don't like ripping things. So I've got my trusty scissors. Oh, it says something on the front. Oh, Merry Christmas! Oh, thank you. It's a little bit late. I'm sorry I'm opening this so late, guys, but I really just wanted to keep everything until I had a nice big pile of mail. Oh, this is so packed. Ah! Okay, I'm gonna have to rip it. Wow. More stuff. Okay, it looks like we've got a whole bunch of 
stickers and those, what are they called, like life cards? I think they're called life cards. There's little, oh no, these are, wait, wait, wait. Let's start with the biggest. So we've got first, we've got a beautiful postcard of Adelaide. So I'll pop that in my collection, my um, postcard collection. Then we'll go to these big ones here. Oh, cool. So we've got just colorful little bits of paper that I can craft with. And then, oh, these are from the Flow magazine. How cool is that? And then little sticker sets, little tags. And then, oh, these are like masking, like these are stickers, but they're, they're strips. I've seen these before. Wait, sorry, is that in focus? I've got it on autofocus. I don't know why it's doing that. Oh, that's so cool. So there's a whole bunch of them. So they're pretty much like little washi tape samples, but they're little sticker strips. Does that make sense? <laughs> So we've got lots of different colours here, which is really, really cool. I love all of these. Oh my goodness. Okay, so those are the, the they're called masting strips. And then we've got the little life cards. I think they're called life cards. I've maybe been saying it wrong. That you can um, craft with and a whole bunch of them. Wow. Thank you so much for that. That's just incredible. I love it all. And I'm going to be putting these ones on my fridge straight after I uh, make this video. Thank you. So next is a letter from Julieta. <laughs> for some reason I made that rhyme and I don't know why. Oh, a little cute little... Oh, how cute. So we've got a little about me. And then we've got the little letter. And then she's added some little bits and pieces in. Very, very good. Oh, look! <gasps> no way, it's Milky. I can't remember what the girl's name is. That is so cute. I love that so much. Thank you, and I can't wait to read your letter. So my camera just died and I was in the middle of filming this beautiful letter. So this one is from Asha. And they sent me some really cute tea. And the tea is actually called Asha, which I thought was really awesome. So I can't wait to try the tea. Little cutouts, a little card, and a little letter. So I can't wait to read that. Um, and thank you so much for sending me something in the mail. So this next one is from Pen Paling Paula. I'm pretty sure that's her name on Instagram. Um, but as you all, as some of you may know, I don't know if a lot of you do follow her on Instagram, she creates these adorable postcards and I ordered this online um, and they came in. I was so excited because I can take these to the different countries that I travel to and basically they're postcards and they're all the different um, stationery shops in each country. So Tokyo, um, Lisbon... Toronto. So she's got lots of um, stationary ideas, which I thought was really, really cool. So um, I'll leave the link in the description box below. Paris, if you guys want these. Um, this isn't sponsored or anything. I just thought they were really cool. And I really wanted to do stationary shopping in every country I visit. So yeah, I bought these and I can't wait to take them when I go traveling. So I can go visit out all the local stationary shops. New York City... Amsterdam and London so thank you so much for that also look how pretty this adorable stamp is I'm going to cut that out and put that in my journal so this is uh, another thing that I bought online so I bought some more stationery this month um, again this isn't sponsored majority of the things that I show in my PO box opening videos are things that I personally loved and bought and I wanted to show you guys so as you can sh see she wrote me a hand let handwritten letter uh, and it just says if um, she basically just asks if I can give her a review so I thought that was really cool um, and that's a little store down there Jit and Jack so I'll put I'll definitely put a link in the description box below with anything that I show you guys in these videos um, and I thought the packaging was so cute so I bought this ages ago just making sure that I didn't leave anything I bought this ages ago and basically I bought two packs of these stick animals and I just thought they were so cute and I wanted to do some forest themed um, snail mailing or, st or even journaling even. Um, but I just thought they were so, so adorable and I bought two packs. I'm pretty sure they were quite cheap. 
Alright, so this is the last order I bought this month. And to be honest, I don't usually buy a lot of stationery, but I sort of went on a stationery spree. And these three things were bought throughout December, January and February. So I probably only bought one pack each month. So I just wanted to let you guys know that I don't buy a lot of stationery. I just try to buy like one or two things each month. And I do work a lot now, so I've got the funds to do it. So I don't want anyone to feel like I'm like promoting buying a lot of things because I know you can make a lot of crafts um, with lots of pre-used things or things in the op shops or things you can find around the house but I just wanted to share these with you in case you also wanted to grab them and I love supporting independent artists um, rather than supporting big chain stores so yeah I really just wanted to do a little shout out to all the independent artists that are making really awesome stationery so this is the little store that I bought them from I'll probably, probably put that in my journal as well I bought a whole bunch of postcards um, and I haven't opened this up yet so I'm actually really excited and as you can see again there's the name of the shop, but again, I'll put the link in the description box below. Um, it says Happy Post Crossing because there's a website you guys may know called Post Crossing where you send cards, postcards. But I just thought these were just so beautifully designed and I loved them so much. Like, and even the little pencil on the back. It's just so pretty. And as you know, this is pretty much my style, these colours. So beautiful yellow. And look how cute these are. I might actually even cut this one and use all... No, I can't. I can't. It's just too pretty. I'm honestly, I'm probably going to keep this one and put it on my journal. I don't even want to send it. And then I got this one because, of course, you guys know I love my cacti. So those are the three cards. They're absolutely beautiful. And then also these sticker sets. I'll try to do a really good close-up on these. So a little washi tape, little post box, love this post box, happy mail, little happy mail. And yeah, I got two of these and they're really nice and thick paper. So I thought that was such a cute little package. Um, and yeah, again, I'll put the links in the description box below. And I would love it if you guys could also help out independent artists. Um, because I think it's a great way of buying stationery rather than going to the bigger chain stores because you're helping someone start and run their own business. So yeah, let's continue. So this next one here is from Hayley. I know that I've written to you a few times. Um, and I haven't actually looked inside of the letter, I just opened the top up. And we've got the letter here and it says, open me. I think that's so cute. <gasps> How pretty is that? I love that so much. We've got some a beautiful sticker sheet here. Sorry, the light's going down so it, the camera's trying to focus and it can't find it. <gasps> I love this. Wow, that's so pretty. I'd love to know where you got that one from. Um, very, very pretty, that one. I can't wait to use it. Then what have we got here? Oh, how sweet and cute that is. <laughs> so cute. <gasps> Oh, thank you. How cute is that watercoloring? That's definitely going in my journal. Just be yourself. And then the cute little cacti with his little cacti face. Free hugs. Oh, that's so cute. Um, everything's really cute. Sorry, I keep using that word to describe things, but it's my favorite word, so bear with me. Little tags. These are really lovely tags, aren't they? I love that shimmer on that one. Thank you. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, <gasps> what is this? Are these seeds? I think this might be seeds. I can't open it. Whew. Yes. Oh, yes, that's so cool. Thank you so much for these seeds. I'm going to try and plant them. To be honest, I don't have a green thumb, but if I do successfully plant them, I'll let you know. <laughs> I'll try at least. Such a cute little package. So very, very cute. Nice aesthetic. Beautiful purples and pastels in that one. Thank you. So this one is from Ashley from California. And I'm just going to try not to show the address. I'll flip that over and put that aside. What is in here? Is this a little card? Let me see. Oh, okay, so there's the note inside, so let me just see if I can open it up without showing the note. 
And then we've got this adorable watercolour in here. Thank you so much. I'll read your little card in a second. I didn't realise that the writing was going to be on that. So thank you so much. And I can see that you've um, drawn all over the envelope as well, which is really cute. There's some cacti on the back. Um, but I won't show you the back just because the address is on it. Thank you so much. Can't wait to read it. So this big one here is from France. And I remember that I got a package from this lady. Um probably like a year or so ago because she gave me um, lots of Christmas stationery that I was obsessed with and I kept for an entire year to use and I haven't actually looked inside I just opened it up and oh my goodness she sends the most beautiful packages I am just obsessed so uh, firstly look how lovely her stationery is like these tags are just so so cute and it says, it says, Happy New Year, which shows how long I've had this mail for and haven't opened it up yet. So I am sorry that you guys have to wait a little bit longer for me, but I really love opening these up on camera. So I do wait. And because I'm getting less and less in the mail, because I'm not accepting any new pen pals, I do tend to keep them for a long time to show you guys when I've got a whole bunch. Oh, I just love those stickers. <gasps> Your stationery is just to die for. <gasps> How cute! Alright, I'm gonna try doing this without ripping it. <gasps> this looks made! Did you make this card? Oh, I love this so much. I'm actually gonna keep this envelope. <laughs> I'm keeping this one and resending that. <laughs> so it says, New Year, New Vibes, and then there's a little letter on the back, but I won't read it. And then we've got a beautiful package in here. Again, Look how cute this washi tape is. Some of you guys just have the most amazing stationery collections at home. I would love to like visit all your collections and just spend hours going through it. Oh, you didn't, look. Oh, you didn't have to buy me anything. This is so amazing. Are these like washi tape strips or are they like, they look like fabric but it looks like they're going to be sticky. Oh, so make sure it's in focus. Got beautiful birds. Oh, these are so cool. I'm going to have to, I'm definitely using some of these throughout the year but I'm going to have to keep some and create another Christmas package with what you've given me. Thank you so much. I love these. And what is this? Oh, no. Look at this beautiful paper. Oh, I love that bow so much. I just don't want to open it, so I'm just going to flick through it. So we've got this beautiful... Yes, she did make the card, because look. It's the same paper. And then these beautiful ones with dots and stars. Oh, it's similar to the styles here. I love that paper. Thank you so much. I think I'm going to try to find this shop online, because everything so far is just absolutely adorable. Look how... It's all close up for you. Look how beautiful these designs are. I usually don't like a lot of Christmas designs, but these are just absolutely beautiful. Thank you so much. Oh, and there's more on the other side. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I can't wait to use these. I'm going to try to use them throughout the year, but I might do a package at Christmas time at the end of the year and use your beautiful stationery. Thank you again. Um, and I'll try to reply earlier this year. <laughs> Love it. Thank you to everyone who has sent me something in the mail. I really, really appreciate it. I'll put the three links to the Etsy shops um, in the description box below. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.